What is up, YouTube? Today's video, as y'all see from the title, we're going to be talking about Colorado. I do make a lot of videos on Colorado, but it's, I'm so proud of this program. But let's dive into this straight to the point. Um, Shador Sanders, 30 of 43, 291, three touchdowns, 78 QBR. They didn't have a good rushing game. I think they ran for 60 yards total as a team with Isaiah leading with 32 yards rushing and 10 carries. I feel like they need, they need to give him the ball more because he's a solid running back. Um, Travis Hunter, nine receptions, 99 yards, one touchdown. Wester, 82 yards, one touchdown, six receptions. Shepard, eight receptions, 79 yards. Bro, she, she was slinging that thing. On the Texas Tech side, Morton, 275, two touchdowns, one interception. They ran a ball pretty solid against uh Colorado, which should be scary for Colorado because we should be we need to stop that running attack. Brooks ran for 137 yards and 31 carries. God dang, 31 carries. They need to give the, that's how many August Eve needs. That's how many carries he needs. Oh, uh, their leading receiver was Josh Kelly, 106 yards, zero touchdowns, but eight receptions. And leading touchdown was Conyers, two touchdowns, 50 yards. Um, but that's just the stats from the game. Uh, how do y'all feel? Because with I thought this was going to be like a closer game. Pretty much Colorado really just blew them out. Not even close, for real, for real. The final score doesn't even say how bad the game was. Not bad, but how Colorado was just dominating on all sides of the ball. Um, So that wasn't their tough game like I thought. Their tough game going to probably be Utah. Because if y'all didn't see the Utah game, it was 22-21. to 21. They lost by a field goal. And Utah gave BYU a run for their money. I don't know if because BYU probably not that good. Like how people think they are. Well, Utah is just an underrated team, and their record doesn't say that. So, we need to prepare for that. They they need to prepare for that. Um, Utah game, like really prepare for that, cause that's scary. I thought we were gonna. I thought Texas Tech was gonna be the hard game, and then the other three was gonna be easy wins. But Utah might give us a run for their like might be tough. Kansas and Oklahoma State. I'm not even worried about them teams. Uh, those teams both suck. Bad year for them both. Um, so we should blow those teams out or beat those teams. But do y'all think Colorado can make the playoffs? Because if we went out, that we're seven, they're seven and two right now. That's ten and two. Do you do y'all think we can win out? Do y'all think do y'all think they can win out? I actually honestly, from the bottom of my heart, I did think they can win out. And I don't know. Do we BYU BYU was struggling against Utah. If we blow out Utah and BYU was just struggling against that says something. If we if we play Utah and I keep saying we like I'm a fan, but I really am a fan of Dion. Uh, if we play Utah and we blow them out, that should say something about maybe BYU isn't the best in the conference like people think they are. Maybe it's Colorado. And in my humble opinion, what I've seen from the games I've been watching, I honestly do think Colorado is the best team in the Big 12. That's just me, though. Uh, y'all might be like, oh, you chatting. But from what I've seen, they got similar schedules. Their schedules were both not strong because if you look who uh, BYU played, I think their toughest team they played was SMU and maybe UCF. But I wouldn't even say UCF. SMU was probably your toughest opponent, and they won 18-15. to 15. Colorado's toughest opponent was probably, people say, probably Nebraska, and we got, yep, yeah, Nebraska was probably our toughest opponent. Uh, maybe UCF. I don't know. I don't think UCF either because we shitted on UCF. And Nebraska, we just didn't play well. So probably UCF. Maybe Kansas State. But then again, I don't know about Kansas State. Well, pretty much similar schedules. Not the best teams on their schedules that they're playing. So it just depends. It depends on this Utah game. If I see this Utah game, when I see this Utah game and we blow them out or we beat them in any way, like, then don't struggle. Colorado is more than likely the best team in the conference, regardless of if BYU was 6-0 in the conference. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Leave your thoughts down below in the comment section down below. And uh, peace out.